This video is meant to help anybody who's interested in buying a magnetic stirrer hot plate from eBay. This will be a review of the SH2 Magnetic Stirrer Hot Plate Duo um, that I bought off eBay. It cost me $51.80 total with shipping included and I purchased it from Deal Party 360. Here I'm just opening the package and it actually was smaller than oh, I had anticipated. I thought it was a larger size comparable to ones I've seen on YouTube, but it turned out to be about half the size that I thought it would. It comes with a manual that actually is pretty easy to read. There's no typos or like weird grammar, which is encouraging. The hot plate itself comes packaged in two styrofoam halves that are taped together to protect it. And here I'm just trying to get the thing open. So this particular model um, seems to be that there's like a bunch of copies of it and it was funny, there was even an ad that said um, ours is genuine, I forget what the, the model it was, I think it, yeah I forget what it was, but it said that ours is genuine and the SH2 is a copy or rip off, and, um, but they're pretty much all the same model as far as I could tell just by looking at pictures and um, seems to be the way it goes when you're buying stuff off eBay, everyone uh, resells it. I was a little concerned about the size. Um, there you could see I was just kind of trying to picture what large, how large of a beaker I could fit on there or a flask. Um, but I actually think it'll work pretty well for what I need it to do. Being that it's smaller, it actually won't take up that much counter space. And um, I'll make another video of me actually doing a distillation, probably several videos or a ton of videos doing distillations with it. So um, hopefully it will work out. If it doesn't, I'll let you know. It's nice that it came with a magnetic stirring bar, even though those are super cheap. Um, it allowed me it allowed me to test the stirring feature on here to make sure that works. I decided to just boil some water. I also have a thermometer that I recently purchased for dirt cheap off eBay and the speaker that I've never heated. I've only used it for mixing oils for perfumes. So here you can see that the stirring element works, which is convenient. And we're just gonna boil boil some water, bring it up to 100 degrees Celsius. The RPMs on this go pretty quick. I turned it up, I cranked it on before I took the video of it and it gets going pretty fast. Actually I believe it says in the manual that it uh, let's see here. It will do up to 1600 RPMs, which is pretty fast. That's way too fast to boil water with unless you had a really large beaker. So that's great. Um, there was a point here we're almost at boiling when you could see the water vapor coming off. There was also some smoke coming from the back of the, the actual hot plate. Um, so I had to crack some windows because it was putting off some fumes. I'm not sure what it was. I couldn't see anything it was so faint that I couldn't see anything melting or anything you know on fire obviously so I'll probably email them about that and just ask why that why that is what it could have been but um, after about 10 eh, after about five or ten minutes that stopped and so I don't know if it was just maybe some grease that was hot that was smoking off I'm not sure here we're at a hundred degrees C though and water's boiling and I just turn off the heat and turn the stirrer down low so it will it'll keep circulating, but uh, it'll work for what I need it to.